Hey, what's going on guys? It's me Charmy here and welcome back to another brand new Delta and fan game video and today we are back on Delta Traveler because section 3 is finally here. So yeah, let's continue from the last uh, demo, half demo you can say or something like that. So uh, yeah, um, let's go down. This is uh, kind of eerie. You can barely see into the darkness. Can you see anything, Chris? I I can't see anything. Should probably grab the torch then. Hell, I'd probably say to grab it even if you can see. It's really dark. All right, take the torch. There we go. Wait, hold on. The hell is Snowdrick doing down here? Hey, what are you doing? <coughs> uh oh. The hell was that? This isn't funny, dude. S Susie, I don't think that's a normal snow drink. Huh? Wait, what? There we go. This is where it was cut off last time. Alright, let's see. We can, um, heckle maybe? I'm not sure. Let's see. Okay, nothing happens. Kim Tar. Okay, so we need Noel for this? And, I don't know. Okay, I suck at this. Oh wait, there we go. Ba boom, ba bye, bye. Have a good one. Hey, wake up. W w w huh? Was that all a dream? Nope. You were trying to eat us. So what the hell is the deal? Okay. Me and a few friends came here to look for Snowy, but everyone started to lose their minds, including me. Oh yeah, Snowy. Have you seen Snowy? Well, uh, I think he's up the ladder near some cardboard thing. Really? Excuse me. The hell was that? Do you think the forest is putting them into a feral state? Seems like it. Uh, I guess we should keep an eye out for that. Wait, what's this? It's an H. I'm pretty sure it's a part of a ladder, Susie. Oh. Um, I guess I'll hold on to it. So you got a ladder piece. Let's get going. Wait, can you not... Yeah, you cannot see the ladder in inventory at all. Alright, cool, whatever. Okay, what about... Let's call home, Daling. Hello, Chris. Um, why is it so windy where you are? It isn't even that breezy today. Where even are you? In a snowy forest underground traveling dimensions? Chris, please stay safe. <laughs> please stay safe. Call me back soon, too. And... Yep, no one picked up. Oh, man. Knock, knock, knock. Who's there? You better not be here to terrorize us again, bonehead. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill, dude. I've never even met you before. QC? Is that you? Wait, like the restaurant? Who told you my name? Huh? Oh, I've just known for a while. Ah, whatever. We all seem like you're not here to kill us anyway. Why don't you all help yourselves inside? Once you put up that torch, knock knock knock, put up the torch and I'll let ya in. I've got two torches holders surrounding the door if you didn't notice. Alright, sorry. <laughs> put the torch, there we go. Knock knock knock, come in, come on in. Well, come inside. Much nicer than the dark forest, huh? Yeah, a bit cramped though. Why do you guys even live down here? Well, we all lived in Snowden Town a long time ago. Wasn't the best place given how the underground is, but it was nice enough. That was until two brothers snapped one day. They started going on a murderous rampage. I know killing isn't too uncommon here, but this was just a massacre. Got to the point where we had to hide ourselves somewhere to avoid them. I still run my shop there to keep up on supplies. Well, up recent, up until recently, what happened? A bunch of wild snowdrakes attacked me on my way down here a week ago. Broke the ladder into pieces. I got most of the pieces, but I'm still missing a few of them. Left my axe at the shop too. I've been stuck here ever since, trying to find them before I try and tempt fate. Well, we happened to get one of them just now. Apparently one of the snowdrakes was holding onto it. Really? That sounds wonderful actually. I've never been able to get near them let alone put a dent into them. Would you mind helping find those pieces? Well, uh, it's the only way we can go forward. We're trying to get to Hotland. 
Well, then we need to get those pieces, but I imagine that might be a harrow harrowing task. Say, I just noticed, is that you, Miss Noel? Huh? Well, yeah, you've grown a lot faster than I expected. Tell you what, since y'all helping me out, I'll let y'all stay the night. Heck, I insist you take a rest right now before you get going. Um, I guess we can. I think we only have two bedrooms to go to sleep in, uh oh. <laughs> two of y'all might need to share a bed. <laughs> I knew it, Noel. <laughs> Chris, you should probably take the single bed. What? But I don't want to share a bed. Do you want Chris to steal all the blankets? Okay, fine. <laughs> I'll share the well. Oh my god. Oh, dude. <laughs> oh, like, actually? Wait, what? You felt that you should go to sleep. Okay. Wait, oh my god. Yo. <laughs> I swear, no, I was gonna get closer. Um. Never mind. Yeah, never mind. It's fine. Okay. The History of the Kingdom by Gerson Boom. You turn to a random page. After his declaration of war on the humans, the queen tried to overthrow the king. This was the only time the royal guard was given a direct order of violence by the king. The queen was banished to the ruins, to the anguish of his majesty. With such a violent end to their children, the queen's coup attempt. The kingdom fell into a deep depression, one that persists to this very day. King Asgore continues to try his best to bring hope back to the people, but with how things have been for the good part of a century or so, who's to say it will? And this is the Underfell version if I'm correct, so it's not the original Undertale when you decide to climb into bed. Oh, are we gonna have like uh, the dream thingy part? Like, section 1? What did I do? Oh, it's the weird Chris, other Chris? It feels like I'm drifting without my input, doing things against my will, yet everyone thinks it's just you, Chris. What did I do to deserve this? Am I just cursed? Why do I deserve to be cursed with the, rem the removal of my agency? What about the me from all these other worlds. Do they also suffer this curse? Is this just my fate? I want to end it so badly. All I want to do ooh, is rip it out and just. <gasps> Whoa! It's all blood? Wait, what? Is it not determination? Uh oh. Uh, uh, I, I can't breathe. S Susie. Noel. Hasriel. Someone. Anyone. Please. Help me. Please. I don't want to die all alone. Whoa. So is that actually Chris or I don't know. Mm -hmm. Chris? Mm -hmm. We've been knocking for like 5 minutes today already. <laughs> Sorry. Don't make us come in there. Give them some time, Susie. They're really bad at waking up. Mm -hmm. I've been waiting. Mm -hmm. If you don't come out here, we're living without you. Oh no, Chris doesn't look fine at all. Uh oh. Dot dot dot. Yeah, Chris does not look fine at all. Um. Chris? Yeesh, dude. What happened to you? Looks like you had a hell of a nightmare. It was horrible. Well, do you want to talk about it or something? Oh! <gasps> Oh my god. C -c Chris? It, I don't do hugs? Oh no, no, I was sad. I, I mean, um, I guess it's fine. Uh. Aw, there, there. 
dude, it's gonna be fine. Quit tearing up or I'm gonna start crying too. And you don't wanna see me cry. Chris? We should probably take a minute to talk about this. An outburst like this, it's not like you. Um, sure, we can give you a minute. We can talk about this downstairs if you really want to. Just don't take forever again, okay? Oh. Oh, okay, Chris is gonna rip us out again. Alright, you know what, Chris? I understand. You can go chill out, okay? Alright, just chill out. Everything will be okay. Alright, don't, don't mind me, alright? <laughs> okay? Yeah. Have a, have a good one. Yeah. Um, how are you gonna walk though? <laughs> uh oh. Just, uh, then I start dying because we are not here. Oh, never mind. Hey, Chris got glasses? Wait, what? Huh? Excellent. Truly excellent. We finally have time. For a heart to heart. So, Chris. Wait, Chris? Wait. Oh, did I? Wait, no, I think I did, like, name the character Chris. Yeah, I'm sure it is exhausting to be character to Chris. Why don't I offer you an opportunity to escape? I shall allow you to craft a vessel. Let us begin. Which head do you prefer? Wait, what? We're doing this again? Yeah, why not? Which torso do you prefer? Uh, this one, why not? Which legs do you prefer? Okay, this one, if I'm correct, it's all the same except for the last one over here, which is like myriad for some reason. So uh, yeah, let's get this one. <laughs> this is your body. Do you accept it? Yeah, why not? Excellent. Truly. Now, let us shape its mind as your own. Yeesh, dude, that sounds like hell. It appears we have run out of time. We shall continue this very, very soon. Oh, it goes under the bed, jeez, that's scary. Chris, you really should have told us sooner. We could have helped you out, could helped out, sorry. Or try to do something at least. Chris, don't bother worrying about, I don't know, standing still, I guess. We're not gonna think it's weird that you're uh, a little robotic. Well, it's a little weird, but you get it. We'll get through this together, Chris. I hope we can at least try to keep it under control. Thanks, guys. Hey, Chris talked! Don't mention it, dude. Anyway, we should probably get moving. All that talk about this civilization from earlier is debug is bugging me. We need to find Elphis before that gets worse. Let's get going. Well, after you grab your uh thing. Yeah. See you downstairs. All right, Chris. See you in a bit. Oh. Oh no. Chris, you okay? Why does Chris have to like you know like 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 you know walk like this? Why? I don't get it. Wow. Oh wait! <gasps> hey, Chris got eyes now! Let's go! It looks like a glasses for some reason for me, but I assume that is their eye, right? Yeah. Can I go to their room? I wanna see, man. I wanna see. Oh, what? Come on, no need to go back upstairs. Why? There's a show being played on the TV. MTT Destruction Derby, Episode 5. It seems to be playing off of the video cassette player below the TV. Y'all need some guidance first? I've got a few ideas on where the last three are. I think there might be one in the southwest of the forest in the pretty long dead end. Try not to get cornered by a bunch of snow drakes. There's another in a shorter dead end near the center of the forest. I've always seen it guarded by a snowdrick, so you'd either have to lurk it away or try to kill it. There's also another one near a cliff southeast of here, but that's a strange one. It's never guarded by anything, but every time I'm brave enough to grab it, it's gone. It might be a trap, so I'd say grab that one last. Good luck out there, you tree. I'm sure it'll be fine if you slept 
upstairs again but something tells me that you're very limited on time so I wouldn't recommend it what if the gray door vanishes Chris let's not <laughs> I wish me and my little cinnamon here could take walks more often we used to do it occasionally but now it's too dangerous to go out anymore at least we're safe the coziness of this home fills you with some kind of shining hope the power of bunny shines within you so I actually am bad at directions, so I can't do it. I seriously can't. Oh, there we go. So you got a letter piece. Oh my. Okay, that actually jump scare, bro. Snow Pharaoh and Bridge Shield from the shadows. I don't think we can do anything. So let's just do defend, defend, and an action. There we go. Wait, what? No, what? Snowdrick? Oh, maybe we need Susie too. I don't know. I thought maybe only Noel needed that. I go as action and then sleep miss maybe. Yeah, I'm tired. You need Susie and Noel for that, I think. Oh my goodness. Hey, defend. All right, as action and action. action. Oh wait, no, we need Chris for that too. Okay, all right. Cool. Yeah, I'm actually gonna die now. Yay! I'm gonna die. Oh my god. It's fine. Echo, sleep miss. There we go. There we go. It's got a ladder piece. Let me just go and save real quick. Oh, give me that. So you got a ladder piece. I think this might be the last one. Let's go see QC and see if we need to find any more. Uh oh. Oh no, I should not have done that. I only grabbed like two. What the hell is going on out there? Is Tad Chris? Start running! Oh no, 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 bro. Uh, what? Okay, okay, okay. Nah. This is not okay. Ow. But, dude, the thing is, I haven't grabbed all of them, right? Oh no. Found you. Uh oh. Back the hell away, freak. Nah. I've got you right where I want you. What? Well, what do you want from us? You know, every time I've held onto hope, it's just eroded away. It's about time you felt what I felt. But that doesn't answer the question, dumb. Like I tell you about how I felt. You should know. Hey, rabbit lady, open the door. She's not gonna help. No one will. You can't even help yourselves against me. You sure you wanna try us? Dimension travelers that can take on a giant mech? S Susie, don't, don't! You're really getting my expectations up, but I don't believe you. Now, enough talking. Time to die. Oh, what? Oh, thank you. Gotcha! Get the hell away from them, you damn... Uh-oh. Oh, let's go. Thank you! QC, are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, but... He got away. Feels like every time I get a chance to kill him, he runs away. So much for his kill or be killed red rhetoric. Uh, thanks for saving us, but um, we've got like four of those letters parts. I only got two or three technically. Or wait, how many did I got actually? I don't know. Do you know if we need to get more? All oh, right, I believe that's all of them. I'm carrying the ones I found right now, so let's go ahead and review the ladder. Meet me over at the end of the east of here. Oh my goodness. Descriptive. I'm sure she means there's a cliff where we can build a ladder to. I guess, but uh, what about the whole I'll keep a leash on him a bit? Uh, maybe, um, oh, Sans left after the ladder attack. Maybe he ran away while Papyrus was distracted. They'll both run away after I beat him up. Now, let's go. Alright, I'm gonna explore more first, I think, actually. Alright, I think I've checked on everything in this maze. I feel, I don't know. Hey, y'all brought a torch. Now, let's go ahead and start building that ladder and get the hell out of here. Alright, let's go. Oh, no. It's behind us, isn't it? Damn it. 
I'm sorry to ask this of y'all, but can you take care of this last snow drink? I can take that torch from you if you'll make things easier. I guess so. We've got no real choice anyway. Here we go. Alright. Oh, wait, we can agree now? This is another one. Wait, this is children, isn't it? Let's see. Um, never mind. Let's do Clash. We're gonna tire it out, I think. You tell Pharaoh Drake it's all wrong. Nothing happens. Just he points a weapon at Pharaoh Drake. Nothing happens. What? Oh, no. It's yeah, this is definitely Childrick, right? Man, I thought maybe doing the same thing would work, but no. Is it me or is this one not tired yet? Okay, maybe we can joke. Let's see. You make a bad ice pot, nothing happens. He points her weapon at Pharaoh Drake, nothing happens. Uh oh. Bro. Oh no, oh no. Why is this just not working? Oh, I'm gonna die. Mm. Hey, stop! Oh. Childric, what what's happening over here? I heard roaring from really far away. What's wrong with you? Uh oh. Chili, calm down. I heard everything. I'm okay. Come on, dude. It's me, Snowy. Don't you remember me? Hey, it's working. God, what the hell have I been doing for this long? That haze just like drove me crazy. But you're fine now, right? Hell yeah, Snowy. Let's dish this for us already. Hey, I almost died. Let's go. Wow, I didn't expect that. Anyway, I finally got the ladder built. So I'm getting out of here. Again, thank you all so much for helping us out. It's our pleasure, QC. And hey, that means we can also get going too. So let's get going. Oh, it's like brightened up now. Hey Chris, is it me or are we being watched? What do you mean, Susie? I don't know, but something feels off. Like someone's watching our every move. I guess keep an eye out, Chris. It's Flowey, I saw him. Oh, what's going on here? You're literally in a high level writing course. Why do I hang out with you? What is this big sign for? This thing isn't gonna stop me because I can't read. Now I know what you're thinking. Wasn't there for great tricks? No, but now I'm worried. Okay, that dude is chilling somewhere else. They need to reflect on this whole thing so they aren't hanging out. I hope they're okay. Wow, what an ice party we have here. Enough with the puns! Whatever, everyone is here. Did you guys do this? Yeah, we got everyone to be nicer and make the crazy ones less crazy. Thanks a lot, you guys. This is the one nice thing I'm doing for them. Man, I'm so hungry. How hungry? <laughs> what? Definitely not hungry enough to eat this spaghetti. Bet this was made by that tall skeleton man, which means it sucks. More for me. I'm the coolest. He's lying. I'm much cooler. You're both lame. Being Pharaoh felt so weird. Everything I did was in this weird desperation to survive. Case in point, I know what tree bar tastes like now. Why? I ate a whole tree. Oh wait. <laughs> it feels so nice to be out of the house again. I wonder if this is how it'll feel going to the surface for the first time. Alright, here we go. Yeah. <laughs> so like, how was the forest down there safer than whatever's over here? It looks like the bridge over there is broken, a and a ton of spikes too, but it was the bridge. Turn every axe into, then press a switch. Love it when the answer is just gone. Well, why don't we find out what to do ourselves? Whatever, we don't really have a choice. Turn it to all right, basic undertale stuff. You know, why don't we just step over the spikes? What if they raise higher? That sounds kinda bad, not gonna lie. 
Is it worth it if you aren't alive to see it? You know what, fair point. You've escaped the pits of the forest and returned to the underground wasteland above. You're filled with the power of unchanging circumstances. Oh, what? That worked? Okay. Stop right there! Step to the side, all of you! We've been hearing multiple reports of a human wandering around with a couple of monsters. Have you three seen this human? Uh... Nope. I uh, have no idea what a human looks like. Are you sure? You three smell strange. Well, uh... We just... Um... We, we just helped a rabbit family escape from the deep f f forest. We had to f f fight a few wild snowdrakes down there, so... M maybe it's that? Yeah, that makes sense. Get back to town, all of you. It's dangerous out here, especially with a human prowling around. Okay, got it. <laughs> okay, alright, go. <laughs> Humans dangerous? That's a little presumptuous, don't you think? And how come they didn't recognize Chris as a human? Chris, remember what your mom said? Or what your mom from the purple cave thing said? They wanted to like take your soul or whatever. I mean, I don't know. What do you think is up? Just going to see a group of them. Something happened to them. So like, what do you think that they went to that they went to war or something? I wonder if in this underground world, humans and monsters were more violent towards one another, which is a bit worrying given that we know about human power. Wait, what? Just some boring history stuff. <laughs> huh? Then let's stop wasting time. Let's get going. Ooh. There is a very tempting big red button on the tree. Press it. Yeah, why not? You press the button. Oh. Bro, what is this? Oh, man. <laughs> Chris, why did you push that? You can get up, right? Chris? That happened. Oh, no. Oh, hello there. You! Why the hell weren't you keeping an eye on Sans? What are you talking about? We got ambushed by him, dumb. What? That's ridiculous. He's been diligently listening to me talk right to the set. I thought he was being unusually quiet. You think? Where could he... Oh. He's over there at the next puzzle. So he did get away before I could get over there. Apologies for that. I do know that he's at the puzzle ahead. I can even see him from here. So you all are safe from him for now. But uh, there is another puzzle here for you to solve. I was going to make it into the shape of my face, but Sans wanted it to be more intimidating. So I made it into his face instead. But I'm sure of the solution. Feel free to stand while I figure it out. You totally should not push any cool red buttons that are just idly lying there, laying there. <laughs> yeah. Don't push the red button, Chris. <laughs> I did. Turn every X into O or circle, I don't know, then press the switch. That stupid sign. We found that ourselves. Susie, I don't think it'll know what the one before was destroyed. Sounds like a bad friend if you ask me. Would you like a hint? Well, that's too bad for you because I am still unsure of the solution myself. Well, hurry it up. Well, I'm trying. Okay. What can I? Okay, thank you. Oh, I think I messed up. Didn't? Yeah, I messed up. I messed up. This should work. And then gonna go back all the way over here. Oh my god, I'm stuck, Papyrus! So you have triumphed over the puzzle, and it did not explode either. Impressive, but the next puzzle shall not be so safe. I hope you're skilled at following sets of rules. Nyeh! Ha 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 ha! Wait, he he he, Okay, sorry, guys. Why can't we climb over those rocks, Chris? That'll make this puzzle a lot easier. Easy for you, I think. Chris is pretty short. Oh no. Alright. Oh, 
Wait, what if we stretch them to make them taller? Actually, not. Nah, that wouldn't work with humans. Let's go. Wait, so you can stretch monsters? What? What? Oh, come on. Hello. Ice caps in bushes ambushes you with their caps. Ignore. <laughs> Look at my darn hat. Oh no, they are not tired yet. Ignore. Steal, right? I forgot. When it's defeated, you just steal. Incorrect. Hey, look, new bird and hat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we have like defeated this monster before. So, yeah. Let me just, I think, ignore first. And then we can spare, and then we can add action ice cap. Hello, my hat's up there. I, oh, do we still already? I kind of forgot. Oh wait, yeah, we got an X ignore. Oh my god, bro. We have to go up and down now. Great. <laughs> and then steal. Oh no, we need to. Yeah, we need to steal, right? And then spare. Oh, come on. Okay, great. I suck it. I don't know why, dude. Ignore. Defeated. Okay, so now we can steal, right? There we go. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, why is Flow Wiki popping up, dude? This is not okay. Oh no. Ah, there you three are. It's almost as if we didn't just talk a bit ago. Get on with it. The hell is this? Eager to continue, eh? Well, this puzzle was nicely, er, kind of violently, but still graciously contributed by the brilliant Dr. Elphys. Great. You see, these tiles? I was testing the new functions of this version. I'm surprised I didn't trap myself in with the new force field trapping in the puzzle goer. But as you can see, they vary in different colors and each color has a different function. Red tiles are impossible, you cannot walk on them. Yellow tiles, oh no, is this again? Ah, no, no, I, I can't bro. <laughs> yeah, no way. I read this before in Undertale. I, um, Oh, and if it isn't obvious, Chris shall solve this. As for you, you can feel free to assist them with these signs. What? The hell do we do with this? We can keep track of Chris's smell. If Chris steps on an orange tile, raise the orange. If Chris steps on a purple tile, raise the lemon. Chris can only smell like one thing at a time though, so only one of you needs to hold a sign at once. I understand. Wait, I'm lost. What are the rules again? Chris smells like lemons on purple, but what else? Okay, I guess I'll repeat. <laughs> oh, stop wasting time. Ah, have them remember by trial and error? Then I wouldn't waste any more time explaining. God darn it. Oh, but actually, one last thing. This puzzle is entirely random. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle. That has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. What, Chris is like reacting more now? Yeah, Chris was like static before. Like, you know, Chris opened their eyes. Yeah, get ready. Oh my goat, bro.
What? Bro, are you kidding? You better not make me do this. It's broken. What? Hmm, seems easy enough. You think you can do it, Chris? Oh, no, 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 not this time. No, no, don't do it. Oh, flip. There we go. Take as much time as you need, Chris. Guess you might perish before you get close. Chris, don't try to rush through this. Chris, don't ask me for help, because I don't remember a darn thing about how this works. Good luck, Chris. No, don't leave. Look at the cool colors instead. Bro. Ow. So lemon, lemon, lemon. Lemon? Ow. Ow. Can't go down here. There we go. <laughs> Impressive. It took you z -z -z seconds to complete the puzzle. Elphys wanted to put a 50 second timer on this, but we compromised with more damaging tiles. But clearly, you would not have had issues with timers. Alright, whatever. Your puzzles aren't any match for us, bonehead. Just give up already. Boss, I think it's about time to stop playing with this game with them. Game? Okay, I'm sorry if I read that wrong. No, not yet! I have one more ace up my spiky sleeve! Perhaps it may be too deadly for you. It isn't over yet. Sans? Why did that exit feel so empty? Probably because he didn't do his stupid laugh. But who cares? Feels like we're almost done with this bozos. Let's go. The machine is turned off and you can't seem to find a power switch. Oh no, it's a dog. Can I just... Oh, I can. <laughs> this area feels so much like an empty canvas ready for art to sprout from the ground. You're filled with the power of sculpture. It's some kind of incomplete sculpture. The writing and design has been scribbled out, but you can barely make out what it says. Aware of dog. Please pet dog. What? It's a warm down sentry station. Peek inside? Yeah. There's a dog hiding in there. In here, I mean. What? You approach the lesser dog? What's going on? 